So fast. This is an experiment against my better judgment. I bought some Impala roller skates. They are high heeled Marawa. I'm probably saying it wrong. I do understand who um, inspired and was in involved in this collection, but my pronunciation is crap, so excuse that. I'll try to avoid saying. Maroa. <laughs> um, I saw these high heeled skates and I nearly had an aneurysm. Like most people, it looks insane and I'm so excited to try it out. Um, I did hear that they run a little small. I'm hoping that that information is correct because I sized up. I normally wear a Euro 38 and I bought a Euro 39. If it's wrong, I guess I'll just be wearing thick socks. And I waited until these were on special. I will show you the deal I got. Okay, sorry, you might hear the aircon running or little pumpkin's iPad. She is literally just off camera on the iPad. Um, and I'm going to get on and show you my first time opening these so all I've done is pulled off the packaging bag when it arrived because I was literally in shock that it was this I thought surely it can't be my skates already because I ordered them maybe two days ago and they came so fast so here we go I waited for you this is, I, I resisted every ounce of my being that's not how you say that yeah, you know what I mean I resisted every part of temptation I'm opening these, look at the blue paper inside on. We got informations. There was another one and it went under the couch. Informations, hello my disco friends. Don't get me wrong, I love a high heel, but not all night long. These skates are best for grand entrances, performances and first dates if you really wanna leave an impression. Well, I wonder how long I can last in them. Puppies are barking, outside playing. Oh my God. I should have done that like, so that you could see it at the same time as me, but I got way too excited. <laughs> Dusty can see too. They're cool, hey? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Holy crap. The wheels even have glitter in them. They are they look like high. Pumpkins. They look like pumpkins and I love pumpkins and I kind of dress for the occasion in my Gudetama black milk jumper. Look at the back of this thing. <laughs> and I got my boots with my matching laces on, which are my specially made boots that I recently finally got to reduce my hip pain. Several pairs now that are built up. So that's the, that one and then this one's just low. Um, you don't have to build up the full leg length difference. You can do less, which is what I do, because then you're sort of in a happy middle ground. Less pain, not fully pain eliminated, but it helps. Anyway, get on with these skates. Stop talking about yourself. They look visually uh, like I've picked the right size. I'm kind of glad I went up a size, but I also feel if you're gonna wear something this high for any length of time, you're gonna want a really nice thick sock. Whereas for derby, I wear a really thin sock so I can feel my foot in my skate. And my skate is very low in derby, but I am getting a pair built up. Like I'm currently getting a custom made roller skate boot with my short leg having a small built up platform underneath it just to see if it can help me on the days where my hip is hurting too much for skating, which happens. I have literally been skatey skatey around in circles while I cry, cry crying before um, and I'm with such a supportive roller derby club shout out to Northern Brisbane Rollers that you can cry and skate that's fine it's perfectly okay everyone loves each other there it's family um, I'm not the only person with EDS there that's for sure 
we are all there to support each other. Um, I know we've got at least one developmental skater, a newbie skater starting that um, has EDS, uh, so shout out to that particular skater. We also have um, some older skaters with EDS as well. So roller skating is honestly one of the best things a lot of people find with EDS. Now, again, it's one of those disclaimers, you can't say anything like that on the internet without being taken as giving bad advice, but it's such a gentle movement. It's so glidey and it builds your stability. You have to hold yourself together when you're on skates. I actually fall a lot less on skates than I do on my own feet. And it's because when you're on wheels, you kind of mentally engage your brain to keep yourself together. You hold your hips in, you hold your knees in. You spend so much time holding yourself in on skates. So anyway, okay, this one is ready to go. Unlaced, I'm gonna have to take my boots off. I might have to change the camera angle for this and I'm gonna try them on. Okay, regular leg first. Actually, I can show my shoes side by side like this. So it's subtle in the front. Um, I have to show, it might be easier to show. Can you see that there's a difference? Um, I've got a, a few more pairs that built up, um, but yeah. It helps, every bit helps, and I limp a lot less. That's what I'm talking about. No joke. It's no joke. <laughs> okay, like most skates, don't just try and shove your foot in it. Let's unlace it. Silly me, thought I'd give it a go just because it's already um, the artistic style boot where it's half open already. Oh, my video might get interrupted. School pickup time. Little dude will be coming in soon. Oh, I am so glad I went up in size. That is tight, tight. And I never fit a Euro 39, like ever. So I will be wearing a thin sock with these, which is what I currently have on, because I thought I'd find out first. Zip it. Holy crap, holy, I'm so relieved that I went up its size. Oh, I still got to lace through the holes. Look at the gold detail on this. So pretty. Do these flash? <gasps> they flash! The wheels flash! <laughs> I will be Halloween skating for sure. Holy crap, holy. One, it feels so weird. So weird. Two, I think there's no way you would half ass this and not lace the whole way up. Because, uh, I mean, there's breaking an ankle in normal skates and there's breaking an ankle in normal heels. And then there's combining heels and skates and trying not to break an ankle. Other one, I might fast forward this bit because it's boring. Okay, done with the second lace. I'm going to put the box out of the way. Bye. Put my shoes out of the way. Oh no. Okay, first tip, never get up that way on skates. Always roll so that you are on your front. I mean, you don't have to lay down on the ground like a crab, but get up this way. Knees, hands, one leg, hand to knee. I'll move back a bit so you can see. And I mean, this is freaky even for me getting up in these. So, one leg, hand to knee, other hand on the floor. Oh my gosh. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna move, oh my god, the frame back up. Wow, that's wild. Okay, the center, oh, careful Dusty. Dusty just accidentally shut the camera down. Oh, how can I change the view? I might have to film this bit the other way for YouTubing. Oh, okay, change to 
the long view, let the puppy in the house. Oh my god, I just forgot for a second that I'm in like literal high heels. They feel like I'm scared. <laughs> Have you not wear high heels in a long time? No, it's not that. It's it's actually really nice. It's really fun. I'm gonna have to take these for a proper spin. Um, everything adjustment wise, like I haven't had a look, you should always check your adjustments when you pull any new pair of skates out of the box, but come on, like I think they know that most people would be so excited by these, they're not going to check their kingpins and their axle nuts to see if the wheels are right. So I will check all that before I take these for a serious spin. Um, even here, I feel like I could topple forward very easily. Um, but I am a skater that has all my roller skate plates mounted very forward because I like to lean forward as a speed skater. <laughs> so it's not too bad. I feel like I could adjust to it really quickly. Oh yeah, if you want to see my videos, go check out my Twitter channel. Yes, Dusty wants to have a YouTube channel. She misses YouTubing, but she knows. She knows there's safety issues we need to think about. Yes, but I do have a um, going to. A toker channel, yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love them. I will end this video with some clips of me taking them for a real roll. Probably not today, but as soon as I can. And I go to get painting. Bye. Okay, just had to change into something a little less hot because I've been rolling back and forth. Good day. Shoes out of the way, dog toys out of the way. Thank <laughs> you.